channel, we have a tradition where I suit up for the season finale, but still no pants. And you know why? Because this is a hobby, not a job. Let's begin. All right, lock in. Yeah, it feels like we just started Akashi just yesterday, man. But we've been we've been at this. We've been at this pretty hard. Let's go. Rumia, sisty, sisty. Of course, it's a divine wisdom. It's always divine wisdom. It's not. The guy that he's probably working with is probably divine wisdom. Okay, Mayone. That's right, Glenn did just did it. Bro didn't show for the duel. Wait, what? You know, Sisti is actually such an L recently. Like, fuck, I, what happened to the strong Sisti that we knew in season one? Why can't she do anything about this right now? Because Leo's just overpowered her? I don't know. I feel like Sisti just kind of benched and it's just like... We have to keep saving her. It's like half the season saving Rumi, and now it's like saving Sisti. I wish that she could just shit on Leos too with us, you know? What are you supposed to do? Try my best here, man. Yeah. Like, what does he have over her? Other than being a child of friends, she is, there's no threat, right? What threat was it? Am I forgetting an important plot point? What is the threat? Did he threaten to kill other people around her if you didn't get married? Is it something that's that simple? Because I can't remember Rumia. I'm gonna expose Rumia and her amplifier power. That's what it was. Okay. All right, fine. You can real. Go in. Even real understands. <laughs> this positioning seems very intentional, but I agree. Real should just fucking go in and do it. <laughs> What's Glenn doing, man? He just abandoned the duel. Why is he so beat up? Hold up. Is this after the fight? So bro actually got beat up. This is the, the damage he took against the fucking, what's it called? The, the, the alchemy shit. And he just went to bed and he didn't do shit at all after? Like he just, I thought he was in the fucking, like, I, I thought he was away somewhere doing some crazy plans and being like, Oh, see, Sensei was doing something. Sensei <laughs> No, 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 my bad. So this is before the duel. I thought this is like after the duel and he's just still fucking around here. No, 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 no. This is like right after that night he got fucked up. Rumia came over, said help, and then he disappeared. Now he's up to something right now. Where'd he go? A church wedding? You know what? I'll be perfectly down. We, we just had Konosuba season 3 finale. We had a wedding crash finale. A Cossack Records wedding crash finale? I'm fucking down. Does anyone have objection? <laughs> you gotta get those cat ears back. What the? I'm sorry. That hairstyle. <laughs> Something about the hairstyle looks so wrong on her. I, I need the cat ears back. I, I, put those back into the cat ear bundles. What the fuck? No. no. Put it back. <laughs> Who knows, maybe? Wedding crash time, I can't wait. I hope Glenn shows up drunk and crashes it. No! Oh, it's only the fucking students here. Yo, Glenn, no crash? Right, this is the blackmail. <gasps> no! Don't you dare let this happen! Glenner! Get in here! Open that door! Boom! 
Let's go! The fuck is that? Oh, yeah, he is in the back. He does have the Imperial Army's outfit on again. Just threw a smoke bomb and just took Sistine and we just left and all the kids are fucking cheering. I mean, it's a fucking fraudulent ass marriage, so who gives a fuck? Poor Leo's fuck this guy, man. But Sensei did have the Imperial outfit on, interestingly enough. Then Rumi and Ryo. Classic. Wait, what's she been doing? Is he talking to Serika? Albert? Imperial Army? The smoke pop? Was that? Wait, wait, God! <laughs> Bro does everything but magic. Hey, fuck it. Zafu won't work. I'm gonna bring up fucking more guns, bro. I'm just gonna shoot your ass. It's not a sword, it's some kind of rod. Yeah, it's like a レオスの目的は何だと思う俺もいろいろと可能性を考えてみたが、丸の暴挙に出るほどお前を愛してるってことね。それはあります。この人は私を愛してもいません。まるで別人のように冷たくて。先生。Do they have an army of zombies that are hooked on the fucking juice, the Zaza? Sorry, we shouldn't even come, come. No, we should not conflate Zaza with this, bro. No, 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 no. Leave my fucking Satan's let us alone, bro. They on that angel dust shit. You telling me they control an army of fucking idiots hooked up on angel dust? <laughs> Don't smoke weed, guys. One hit of that joint at a party, you're gonna turn like zombies. Listen to me, kids. <laughs> Personal man, because Sarah Silvers. <laughs> In the church too? Yeah. Put him down! Albert! Yeah. Yo! Who is this dude? It's the first time I'm seeing him! That's a fucking entrance pose, goddamn! Yeah. More Imperial Mages! Yeah. I just shoot him, bald! They on the juice! Angel dust! that's a barbed wire! Yo, 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 the angel dust! Hold the fuck up! I thought they'd be like regular civilians hooked up on this shit. They're moving like fucking superhumans. Okay. <laughs> wait, 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 lightning, light thunder sprites? You just fucking gouged this person's eyes out with fucking needles. Is this magic? Is this magic? Bro, just shooting fucking, you know, needles. Thunder sprites! <laughs> lightning whips! <laughs> Of course they are. Bro, that's how she fucking died? Oh my god, dude. So, like, we're gonna get a repeat of this, but this time we will save Silver Cat, but Silver Dog is dead. That's what it's about? That's what it was about? Angel does production, keep going. Or this is personal and a personal attack on Glenn to remind him of the past so he could put him in further despair because he hates him the entire time? I don't fucking know. Uh, this guy is the drug dealer though, right? It's, it's, this isn't Leos, this is the other guy. <laughs> that bastard is not Leos, that's the other guy right now with the small glasses. It's a dagger, I think. Short bow. Come on, Sifty! <laughs> Bye -bye. 
I ain't gonna lie, this is fucking annoying. Like, of all the things that we've gone through, you're really gonna do this right now? I feel like this is so pointless. It makes no sense. She should know by now how much, you know, she trusts Glenn and like what we should have just let him die. I feel like this is fucking stupid. Like they're the author is doing this to obviously have some kind of other drama going on right now, but this shit is actually fucking retarded. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> Pretending. Pretending. It's not Leos. The true Leos is a good person, but this is someone that's taken over Leos. It can't be Resurrection Life either. Someone just possessed this guy. Executioner. Jatisirofan. Does he go back to the guy that's pulling the carriage? Leos. Yeah, that guy. No, we saw him. He's pulling the carriage. I thought, what the fuck? I mean, Leos did say don't ever... No, no, this is an imperial executioner. Now, he could be divine wisdom related, but the other guy was saying don't let you ever fucking compare to me with divine wisdom. So that guy we fought was this guy. This was him the entire time. He actually dead? He got hooked up on the juice and he died? Ooh. After the mage corpse battle ended, so like last episode, he died. What the fuck? Huh. Damn. The, the emotional damage, the mental damage that he took from our shitty class beating his. He just fucking got hooked on the Zaza, then he killed himself. <laughs> Sisti is actually so fucking pointless right now. Like, this shit doesn't matter anymore. The wedding shit, like, why did the wedding almost fucking go through? Jatis, Jatis was just fucking around, just trying to, I guess, bait, you know, Glenn in, because he has a revenge story against Glenn right now. Maybe, I don't know. Sisti is just, man, Sisti is taking a lot of fucking L's right now. I hope that she's gonna realize how pointless she is and then, like, do something and help Glenn fight and actually fucking do something rather than just be a damsel in distress. <laughs> しかし本当に彼女はセラに似てるね。無線だよ。白猫の結婚も全て。ここでこうして俺と戦うための筋書きだったんだ。オリジナルマジック。クラヴォイエンス。エチコ。ジャスト正義とやらを言い訳に帝
Win magic. Guess who it is? That's right. It's Shiro Neko. Oh! She cut off the bloody part of her dress. The bottom part. You see that shit? Oh, okay. This is better. This is better. I like this from Sisti. If this was not a cliche moment, the enemy right now would donut Sisti and she would fucking die. Because, like, there's no shot and you should be fucking monologuing right now when the enemy is, like, behind you. Alright, I'm glad that she recognized that. There we go! We got all the motivations laid out. I really think that we should look behind, though. Personality the same, too. Oh? So the only reason... Because, like, I was wondering why he had that, like, jacket. The Imperial jacket. But it's looking like the only reason it was there was... Basically, before he had the jacket on, he was going back to, like, military mode, back to Imperial mode. And as soon as Sisti comes back and says, like, this isn't the place you're supposed to be. You're supposed to be our teacher with us. And he's like, all right, I'll take it off. And the school outfit's back on. I thought that he went back to the Imperial course. Maybe he did. Maybe he did go back to the Imperial course and ask for help from Albert and everyone else. But, like, interesting. <laughs>俺が戦へお前が声へ察しがいても愛想を倒して、お前だけは無事みんなのところへ戻ってきてる。二人で一緒にみんなのところへ戻るの。そういう約束なら喜んで受けるわ。やっと初めて私の名前をまともに呼ん
there is no reason he should have left there. But like, obviously the author is intentionally trying to do that because the antagonist is important to the future. So unfortunately, we had a dumb moment like this. You know, I probably still agree that like, even before, right? It's like, who are the real evil people? Is it Divine Wisdom? Which they are, but like the Imperial side, they probably evil as fuck too, right? That was kind of like a plot that happened with the maid before, right? With during the real arc. Can't believe you got away. You could have ended him right there, bro. This is actually so bullshit. Never show your face again, you damn bastard. You could have fucking ended him right now, but you didn't. Whatever. So, uh, now what? Everyone else? Is, is Gibble here? Where's Gibble? Oh, Megan is here too! Of course, Sensei. You're our Sensei. Is that the end? Sensei. And then the castle in the sky? No, nothing? No opening plane? No, no, no. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I want to get more of the guy on the fucking left. The guy on the left, dude. Like, that guy was sick. Unfortunately, we didn't get to see anything after he did his cool pose. Title mentioned again. And the castle in the sky again. Was this the castle? Is a transition scene between the castle and then the maid, Eleanor. Sarika? No, no, that's Eleanor. Eleanor's voice. That's just Eleanor's voice. He probably is, yeah. He definitely is. I honestly kind of feel bad for Ahali because, like, he started off as a hater, then he grew to actually acknowledge Glenn, and Glenn's still fucking just like shitting on him. I haven't seen the headmaster do anything. Hello, Serika. Hmm? Underground Labyrinth. A pony glyph. The underground labyrinth is probably where Eleanor was with the pony glyph, right? This is the intro scene with the kid Glenn reading. My students. Sarah Silvers. Sorry, Sarah. We're gonna be with Sisty now. I hope he ends it by saying, learn it yourself, motherfuckers. You know how, like, we started the season? You know how we, this this whole entire teaching thing by him being like, you know what? Fucking self turn self tough. Watch a fucking movie. I don't care. <laughs> and that, my friends, is Akashic Records Season 1. And we're now going to be waiting for Season 2 content, which they seem to be heavily implying that it could happen. But obviously, I don't know when this anime ended. And if it was like a recent anime, like a lot of new fucking shitty shows continues to get like Season 2 announcements. But like a little bit older animes, even if they lead in with like um things that could happen for Season 2, they don't really follow up on it. So it is what it is. I think that... There's obviously some dumb shit that happened, right? Like, Sisty just, like, slapping Glenn and be like, Oh my god, I don't know you anymore! Or, like, Glenn letting the Justice guy go. But, eh, but th th those are minor inconveniences. I'm just like, that was so fucking stupid. But for overall, just like this season, what would you guys say? I think that in terms of entertainment, it's like 8 out of 10. Entertainment. Now, in terms of an objectively... Object an objective score... Right? To determine, like, how good an anime is. Probably... Somewhere between 6 to 8. I don't know. Somewhere between 6 to 8. Probably somewhere between 7... 7 plus and minus 0.5? I'm not sure. But I think that's a pretty fair score to give this. It was a very... 
refreshing take on magic, right? It was all like, what's the meta? Are we speed casting? Are we slow casting? Are we extending? Nah, we just shooting fucking guns. The bizarreness of Glenn, also Zafuul, and punching motherfuckers out. That caught me off guard, and I actually do enjoy it when he just brings the fucking Glock out and just starts shooting people. The overall mysteries of Akashic Records and the Floating Castle, we didn't get enough of it, but they obviously hinted at it, and I was pretty immersed, but it just sucks that, like, we're not gonna obviously got the answers we want i mean we can read the fucking manga but i can't be doing that shit because you know in case an anime is greenlit then i gotta do blind reactions the overall designs of the characters the girl outfits <laughs> what could i need, need i say more i'm sure the show got fucking viral because of it said it could design amazing glenn radars as a main character i thought it was a pretty good character i thought that this is a pretty enjoyable anime i'm glad you guys recommended it to us and now the game plan for this is we gonna raw dog slime diaries. I intentionally didn't um, make a video asking what do you guys want to watch after Akashic Records. I am raw dogging slime diaries. Whether or not it does well, I, we'll figure that out. But that's it for me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.